Attention! Using always on display or non LED displays can cause heavy battery drainage for screen with IPS displays used with limitations. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how to get Android 12 style ambient display also known as always on display on any Android device even on non AMOLED displays. Now many people will be like hey you stupid it's gonna drain phone's battery like hell. Yes I know but there are people like me who'd like to try always on display on their phones at least for once. Right now this trick's gonna work on both AMOLED screen phones and non AMOLED ones. I'll also tell you some tips to conserve some juice if you are using a non AMOLED phone. So let's begin. You'll need this app called always on AMOLED but not the one on Play Store because that doesn't have the Google Sans font. Sorry Tomer. Since this app isn't official, use at your discretion. Granted some essential permissions but not all. Do not allow unnecessary permission like cause and notification. This is how it looks by default. We're gonna make it look like the AOD in Android 12. Tap customize watch face. Open clock style settings and select S8 style digital. Now open font and choose Trasco which is actually Google Sans light font. Now tap text size and set it to the maximum value. Now choose text color and pick a light color of your choice or you can choose a color which matches to your lock screen wallpaper. Now time to set the brightness. By default it's 12 which is not so bright but good for IPS displays. Do not keep the brightness high on IPS displays. You can have a preview by tapping the play button down here. So this is how you set up an Android 12 style always on display on any of your Android device. Bonus tip. You can set when to show AOT. Tap automatic rules, tap charging, rules and select while charging. You can also choose to display AOD only when your battery is charged to a certain level. This way you could avoid battery drainage even on IPS displays. Let us all know in the comments if you would try this on your IPS display phone or not and also how much did you like this video. So that's it for now. See you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.